Guys, according to Iran's Atomic Energy Organization, there was a terrorist attack at one of their underground nuclear facilities, the Natanz facility. Uh, it was tough timing for Iran, as this weekend they had a big day too. They were celebrating their National Nuclear Day, where they unveiled brand new, more powerful centrifuges, which they uh, say let them enrich more uranium faster. So one day after their National Nuclear Day, a blackout occurred at their big facility on their new centrifuges at the Natanz facility. What a Ooh. bummer. Mm. <laughs> what a bummer. Uh -oh. oh, what a bummer, Iran. That's That's it? Look at that. That doesn't yeah. look like anything. No, it looks pretty <laughs> looks pretty easy to black out. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah ooh, this is a bunch of trailers in the desert somewhere. Right. That's not yeah. even like a, what is that? There wasn't even a fence around it. Well, it's a bummer that their big day got ruined by that blackout, that okay. cyber attack. What wow. a bummer. Sorry, I ran. Bummer, guys. So uh, you, did it ruin the facility? I don't know. I mean, you already saw the facility is not that great to begin with. You, you may remember the Trump administration placed heavy sanctions on Iran's nuclear program, but Iran has been ignoring those and enriching the shit out of uranium. Uh, it's not my uranium. It's uranium, right? And at the time of this recording, Iran hasn't said which foreign entity they think caused the blackout. Uh, Israel is kind of claiming it in a way. It was a cyber attack by them. <laughs> at least, at least according to Israel, uh, Israeli public broadcaster can they said that said uh, it could be assumed that the incident was an Israeli cyber attack. But I mean, like, how many people want to see Iran rocking new and improved nuclear centrifuges, like, and and having a day of worship to worship the new centrifuges? It could really be anyone. Oh, that's that, hilarious! Like, so they yeah. were doing like the blessing thing. Remember, we've covered that before. Where like they have like holy men like uh, kiss the rockets and stuff before they like get. Oh yeah, it was get fired big, off. Or, wait, that was, was in um. Show. That was in uh, actually Belarus, I think, where they had that. Yeah. Well, uh, the, but... the so I'm going to tell you who definitely was there. The uh, the Iranian mm -hmm. Revolutionary Guard Corps. That's a serious group of group of men. Mm -hmm. um, a Akbar Salehi, a chief of the Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps, said uh, Iran reserves the right to respond against the perpetrators and those who committed the terrorist action. Uh, so there you have it. Uh, Iran has called yes take backs. And no matter what uh, their response is, no one can get mad at them because they've reserved the right, uh, which makes no sense. It doesn't matter. I mean, mm. No one wants you to have the centrifuges. Just knock it off. Um, yeah, we don't want you to. Yeah. How, <laughs> how, why are they allowed to have those? I mean, I thought we didn't. Didn't we tell them they weren't? We've supposed told them. To? We've told them. To no, stop. didn't we? We backed out of the nuclear deal. I believe we um, did. We did. Yeah. Well, so but guess they, what? I mean, they can they can do what they want, but it appears that Israel has them on a string. So it's good. yes, but guess yeah. I, I think a lot of people do. Uh, but guess what? We did back out of that, but. Iran and the U.S. are currently in talks over a possible revival of the Iran nuclear deal. So awkward. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Israel, I guess, uh, doesn't give a fuck about that. No, they don't. Mm. <laughs> They're like, look at these idiots yeah. worshiping at nuclear day. Let's shut this shit down. <laughs> Click. <laughs> yeah, turn off the, the tire shop they have in the middle yeah. of the desert. Yeah, turn off the lights <laughs> in that fucking tire shop. <laughs> ridiculous anyways uh, yeah. all right well, well keep so, an eye on them so Iran's upset <laughs> yeah that's yeah they're looking they're like shaking mad they're they no way over. didn't yeah. have that on my bingo card for 2021 yeah and they're just you know trying to get more nuclear and more nuclear day by day uh, but we'll see that's fucking <laughs>